Hi everyone, Dr. Kimberly Riviccio back again with the Else for Autism Foundation. This week I'm going to begin a series of tips that will continue over the next few weeks. These tips will be regarding our cognitions. Our cognitions are the way that we think, they're our thoughts. How we think affects how we feel and behave. We all have experience with what is called cognitive distortions. Cognitive distortions are the patterns of thinking that are negative and maladaptive. These patterns of thinking are very common, but they tend to lead to increased anxiety and stress. It's sort of like the tricks your brain plays on you. Our mental health department at the Ells for Autism Foundation conducts individual and group therapy with much of its focus on our cognitions. Cognitive behavior therapy is one of the many methods used that is evidence-based and can lead to improvements in anxiety and depression. Today's cognitive distortion that we will focus on is catastrophizing. We've all experienced this when we're nervous about something or down about something, we're expecting something to go completely wrong. It's like coming onto stage and imagining that you're going to fall as soon as the curtain opens. It's the worst case scenario. It's expecting that the night will be a complete disaster because last night was a disaster at home. It's expecting your work meeting to go badly because it seems to go bad quite often. One method to manage catastrophizing is to reframe that thought into a more positive and constructive thought. For example, catastrophizing this current pandemic and telling yourself that it's going to go on forever and that everyone around you is going to get sick. Reframing that thought would look like this. This is a very stressful time for my family, my friends, and our world. I'll do my best to get through this time. This is unprecedented with no blueprint. I will take it day by day and do the things I can to keep myself and my family safe. Next week, we will talk about reframing and should statements. I hope you will tune in and don't forget if you would like to work with us individually or in a group session, please reach out. Have a great day.